tennis on Sunday at 8.30 p.m. Eastern from the Rose Bowl in Pasadena, California for Major League Soccer. The Chicago Fire take on the L.A. Galaxy. This will be each of the team's last games of the season and great preparation for the playoffs. MLS Soccer on ESPN2. Sunday night, the Chicago Fire and the L.A. Galaxy. Well, we are getting set for another bout here on ESPN2's Friday Night Fights. Eric Morrell stopping Rodolfo Blanco in round six. Now Lucia Riker steps to the plate against Marcella Acuna. Bob Papa along with Al Bernstein welcome you back to Foxwoods. And Al, Lucia Riker, 11-0, 10 knockouts. We saw some of her highlights. What are some of the key things for her tonight in this fight? She is a 30-year-old that brings tremendous power to every fight. She is certainly the most powerful uh, pound for pound woman boxer in the world today she has a terrific left hook and a jab that is absolutely pulverizing when she remembers to use it and i think the only thing her trainer freddie rose probably is on her about a lot bob is that she should use the left jab a little bit more when she does she is devastating all right her opponent tonight marcelo acuna has 17 wins in kickboxing though in argentina she's 0-1 as a professional boxer but al her 0-1 is impressive isn't it well, here's the amazing thing. She is uh, very well known in Argentina as a kickboxer, is a star down there. Her very first regular boxing match comes against Christy Martin, who is arguably the second best woman boxer pound for pound in the world today. She goes the distance with Christy Martin. Now, in her second fight, here she is against Lucia Riker. That's kind of like a heavyweight getting into boxing and facing Lennox Lewis and then Evander Holyfield. It can only get easier from here on for Acuna. What does Acuna have to do to deal with Riker's power? I think that Lucia Riker is still a woman who starts a little bit slowly in some matches. It takes her a little while really to get loosened up. And I think if I were an opponent of Lucia Riker, it's risky, but I might go to her early and try and get her off her game or maybe even get her cut or hurt early in the fight. I don't know if Acuna has enough power to make that happen, but it might be a strategy for her. Marcella Acuna. A very popular athletic figure in Argentina, a kickboxing champion. Our only professional bout, as we mentioned, the 10-round loss to Christy Martin. But this is obviously a very tough spot for Marcelo Acuna. But one thing you have to say about Acuna, she does not duck a challenge. Not at all. Obviously, fighting Martin, a very tough fight. She went the 10, although she lost the unanimous decision to Martin. And now in against Lucia Riker. And every time you talk about Riker or you see her, uh, I think inevitably people make the comparison between her and Christy Martin. Martin makes a lot more money for her fight. She's better known. But Lucia Riker may be the best kept secret in the world, although she's becoming less so of a secret. She deserves as much acclaim as she can possibly get. What about the influence of Freddie Roach on her? Well, Freddie Roach is an outstanding trainer. Everyone knows that. And their relationship is one that's very good. She's the kind of an athlete that needs uh, the kind of approach Freddie Roach brings, which is a more mild approach, not a rah-rah or shouting kind of approach. All right. This is a title bout. Lucia Riker, Marcella Acuna. Let's send it up to Mark Biro. Ladies and gentlemen, Top Rank Incorporated in association with the Foxwoods Resort Casino and Budweiser. This Bud's for you presents 10 two-minute rounds. Ladies, vacant WIBO Super Lightweight Championship at stake. Your referee for this event from Hartford, Connecticut, Johnny Hallis. Introducing the principals first in the red corner to my left, wearing the blue trunks with the white trim, weighing in at 135 and a quarter pounds. She hails from Buenos Aires, Argentina. Her professional boxing record reads, no victories, one defeat. Introducing La Tigresa Marcela Acuna. Acuna. Her opponent in the blue corner, wearing the black trunks, weighing in at 137 and a half pounds. She hails from the Netherlands and now makes her home in Los Angeles, California. Her professional record undefeated in 11 professional bouts with 10 wins coming by way of knockout. Here is Lucia Riker. Riker, 10 two-minute rounds for the vacant WIBO Super Lightweight Championship of the World.
There is Marcella Acuna and Lucia. Marcella, Riker. Lucia, you received your instructions in the dressing room. I want you to protect yourself at all times and above all, obey my commands at all times. Touch gloves, come out fighting. So Lucia Riker and Marcella Acuna getting set. Acuna will turn 22 on October the 16th. Riker will turn 31 on December the 6th. Five consecutive knockout wins for Lucia Riker. She has four first round knockouts of her 10 in 11 pro bouts. And it may sound odd what I said with those four first round knockouts. It takes her a little while to get loosened up, but it really does. Riker has done nothing but get better and better. She has the power, but has worked hard on technique. Akuna, not a big puncher or kicker. You mentioned that she is a kickboxing champion. Her record of 17-1-1 and in Buenos Aires, Argentina in kickboxing. But only three knockouts. I think Akuna is, is doing what she can early here to make things happen against Riker. She's been pretty aggressive. Of course, she run the risk of walking into some very big power from Lucia. Riker's origins in the sport also in kickboxing, as so many of the women are. That is true with most. Look at the jab of Riker. When she jabs, when she remembers to use that punch and puts everything she has into it, it is a tremendous weapon for her. Remember, women's boxing, the rounds are two minutes, not three minutes. Mandatory eight count, no standing eight count, no three knockdown rule. And you cannot be saved with the bell in any rounds. The time remaining in round number one, ten rounds in women's title bout. Good body punch a moment ago by Riker, and she is capable of that. Come to the end of round number one, scheduled.